The plaid jumpers, the white polo shirts, the pleated pants. The school uniform is known as an equalizer. It creates boundaries which at a glance makes us all equal. But when it comes down to it, this is not the case. You can look at what kind of backpack they're wearing, what brand shoes they're wearing, what brand polo shirt they're wearing, and figure out their background. You can watch them being picked up and look at the car their parents drive. I am at a new Catholic school in Bakersfield, California, and I am more scared than I ever have been in my entire life. I enter the classroom to be stared upon by 30 or so other kids. I slowly look around the room, but at the time failed to notice the fact that there are no other Filipinos in the room other than myself let alone anyone with skin remotely as tan as me. This slowly became more and more obvious as the teasing from the boys persisted. Go back to China, the boys would say, followed by a push or pulling of my ponytail. You're ugly. Go back to where you're from. Go back to China. I'm not from China. I'm not from China. Yes, you are, they would say as they squinted their eyes to mimic mine. Yes, you are, they would say, as they pushed me off the swing. Words that I heard from those boys about a million times over the course of that year. Never did I feel so alone. Never did I feel so alienated. Never did I realize that I was a Filipino-American living in a predominantly Caucasian city. Never did I know that I was different, that this made me different. I hate who I am. I wanted to be white. I want to wake up, stare myself in the mirror, and be white so that the teasing would go away. So I would stop being told that I was ugly. So that I would stop being told that I need to go back where I came from. I want to be like everyone else. I am nine years old.